If you still haven't filed your taxes, you're not alone. The reasons for waiting can range. So what are the options for busy Americans who don't have the time or the desire to get to a tax preparer's office? Well, we have some answers with Karen Roscoe. She's a senior vice president at H&R Block. It's today's sponsored segment. Karen, thanks for being with us today. Thank you for having me. So Karen, can I make an admission to you? Sure. The, uh, when I first learned that I had to do my taxes for the first time, I freaked out. I had no idea what I was doing. I was really intimidated. Do you have any advice for people who look at their taxes and just kind of feel overwhelmed? I do, but let me tell you that you're not alone. It can be overwhelming for a lot of Americans. The best advice that I can give you is allow plenty of time to pull together your tax documents. So make sure that you have everything that you need to get started because missing tax documents can lead to missing tax benefits. And if you need any help with figuring out what exactly do I need, you can use a tax preparation checklist like the one that we have on our website at hrblock.com. Well, that's good to know. I'm just, I, I had that same feeling where I know I have to go through all the checklists of all the different sheets to prepare with. Otherwise, as you said, I'm going to miss out on some money. So how does technology help people who don't have time to prepare for their taxes this season? Well, H&R Block's Tax Pro Go was designed for clients who want all the benefits of working with a tax professional and their expertise, and they want the convenience of not visiting a tax office. It starts at just $49, and clients can upload all of their tax documents. We'll match them with the right tax professional to meet their needs, give them their price upfront, and then they can work with their tax professional through our secure online portal to complete their return. They can talk by phone or, or trade emails as needed as well, all from the convenience of their own home. They don't ever have to leave and they don't have to worry about completing the return themselves. We'll take care of everything. They can just sit back and relax. It's good to know they have some help. So if you get those done, let's say you get the help that you need, this year, people are talking about how the refund isn't as big as it used to be. What if they don't like the size of the refund? Well, if you don't like the size of your refund this year, you can take steps to change the outcome for next year. The easiest way to do that is by updating your tax withholdings with your employer. And tax time's a great time to update your W-4 tax withholdings because a lot of the information that you need for that is contained on your tax return. Doing it in the early part of the year also gives you more time to spread those changes over more pay periods. Now, if you haven't completed your filing, but you've started and you're not liking where things are heading, there are a couple of things that you can do to change this year's outcome. One of those is making a contribution to a traditional IRA. And the best part, that contribution can be made all the way up until the April 15th tax filing deadline, and it impacts this year's tax return. So one of our tax professionals can help you understand whether those tax tips apply to you and what you need to do to take advantage of them. So there you go. Tax Day will be here before you know it. We're getting advice this morning from a pro. Talking this morning with Karen Orozco, the Senior Vice President at H&R Brock. Karen, thanks for being with us today. Thank you for having me. You betcha.